Meditation is the training towards becoming more mindful. If you want to be mindful, you have to meditate. If you want to live a full life of gratitude, abundance, mindfulness, and presence, meditation is required. As a beginner, all you have to do if you want to start meditating and implement it to your life is to just show up. Meditate every single day for the rest of your life. And I'm going to include a sports example since I'm an athlete myself. Let's let's say, let's compare two soccer players. One soccer player who is lazy and doesn't even want to train. He plays soccer, but he'd rather skip practice or training versus the other soccer player that that has no training background, that's only played, you know, dribbled a soccer ball a few times, hasn't had proper cha- training, but he shows up anyways. He shows up to the practice, even though he's not good. But the fact that he even showed up is progress, and he's going to, and he's going to start training getting even better. Which one, compared to both of them, which one is, is going to level up and have more success? Obviously, the one that shows up to training, not the one that didn't show up. So that's all you got to do. Show up to every single meditation practice. Show up to every single meditation session that you, that you plan for yourself. So think of it as this. Every single time you meditate, you just sit on the ground I recommend using me, me, Medito. Me, is that how you say it? It'll, it'll probably be in the link in the description. It's a meditation app. And all you have to do is just meditate for a few minutes, set it to the set the alarm alarm to 5, 10, 30, whatever, how long you want to meditate for. And just do your best to be present. And obviously in a few seconds, your mind's going to wander off. That That's just naturally how our brains are developing now due to technology so we're always scrolling and looking at new content every single 0.2 seconds so it's the same thing with our mind we're always going to wander off you might think about what you're going to eat tomorrow if you have school homework all this stuff and that's going to distract you and get you away from being in the present moment so what you got to do is bring your attention back towards the present moment and every single time you do that you realizing okay shoot i just wandered off let me Go back to my focus and be more present. You're going to level up. That's how you improve. And you want to do that every single day for the rest of your life. Meditation is just the training toward becoming more mindful. You all want to, we all want to be mindful. Let's say you're having a conversation with someone. You don't want to just like focus for a few seconds on them. And then you want to draw off, pull out your phone and you scroll for more dopamine. Because then that, that makes the person that you're talking to feel insecure and you just lowered their self-esteem because they feel like, oh, they're not interesting because you just whipped out your phone because you need more dopamine just scrolling mindlessly. So that's why we got to practice meditation to become more present, especially in social events, with our family, when you're at the dinner table, just when you're going throughout your life. You don't want to be a zombie or some robot with like no personality, no emotions. It's always important to be mindful. And me, for me, I'm also working on this. Because I improve so much. I'm not always on my phone. I don't need my phone in my hand every single moment. But I still get distracted. I still wander off. But that's just something I got to work on. And we all got new things to improve on. So start being more mindful. Start meditating. You can, right after this video, I want you to, this is an, an, an action, actionable step. Right now, after this video, just sit down with yourself for a few seconds. Or just a few minutes. That's all you got to do. And that's great progress. If you want to meditate for like five, 10 minutes, go right ahead. It's not going to be perfect as soon as you start. You're going to wander off, get distracted. But once you get distracted, because that's what we want you to do, you you come back immediately into focus. And imagine that being a rep in the gym, like a, a, a bicep curl, a bicep curl, a bicep curl for your brain. So every single time you wander off and come back to focus, that's a rep. And you already make gains towards your mindfulness framework and your progress so mindfulness is another pillar of self-improvement that you have to improve on and be able to level up that skill because mindfulness and be, being present is a skill just like you have skills in soccer in social skills how many push-ups you can do in a row how many pull-ups all of that's a skill same thing with business you know dating everything life is like pillars like a video game you might have mindfulness as like like imagine mindfulness 100 and that's like your your level at the moment is maybe one or two so if you want to get to 100 or 
Skill 100, you got to keep putting the work and you have to keep meditating every single day so you can work on being fully present and mindful. Man, I remember a few months ago, I was really present. Now, I can say I've leveled up so much in my mindfulness that, bro, I'm really, my phone isn't even in my presence when I'm talking with people, especially with family. I used to have my phone just like in my pocket or at the dinner table. I'll get distracted. I'll be tempted to look at my phone. Now, it's much better. So I can actually say that I'm more mindful and more focused, even when I'm doing my work, especially homework or business. My phone, is, my phone isn't even in, the, in my area, so I don't get distracted. That also has a lot to do with our work as well. When we're doing work, we're fully present. We can be mindful. But now, since we have all this technology, we can, we can immediately just get bored because we're doing work for like an hour or an hour and a half. Then we just pull out our phone and two hours go by just us scrolling. And then you, you wasted like two hours and you could have been working on business or improving your social skills, doing whatever you want to accomplish. So start meditating so you can improve your mindfulness. It's very important for you. It's important for me because if you want to just live a better life and be that 80 year old who meditates every single day and you're just known as that, that cool, spiritual old man that's always present, always happy, always full of gratitude, you have to meditate. Hope you enjoy this video. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. And let me know how your meditation journey has been going because I've been meditating for the past four months. And it's been going really good for me. If, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. It's my Ricky and I'm out. Peace.